O me woya, Jehova jare me woya, I can't hang you de me woya, O me reya no geya. The Biafran economic viability is now out and approved by international countries. <laughs> <laughs> economic viability of Biafran nation now at the top discussion. Mwebo bijato moto una mahota una mahota kai si we kwado. People will not understand. We have been roaming around and trying to do the things that we know how to do best. Saying the things that we know how to say. Pointing fingers at the people that we need to point. It's Nayamari Fine. Exposition has been made. Those who said it is not going to happen now, for no name is Nanyafa, they don't even understand the level. They say, what kind of. What what kind of human beings are these? What kind of human beings are these? This set of people. And that is their wonder. And we told them they should go and buy jar and bucket. Enough because they're going to be shedding tears. We're going to have a lot of tears that will be used as water. People will cry. People will shed tears and all that. So, belonging to the carnival, we must again put ourselves together to understand that the game change that we all ought for must be triggered. Everything is happening. Viability. Do you know what economic viability is? Go and browse it on Google. It takes a country to have it. Any country that does not have it is not is not a country. It's just a noise maker. Any country that does not have it is just a noise maker. But we now have it. And that is what they have been fighting for so long. What is our offense? Can I know my offense? Can I know my offense? It's a simple word. They said no. And the level at which we are heading now is becoming more supernaturally well planned and that is why it's difficult so if we see the necessary things we'll do it well there's no two ways about it we do it well we head out more politely more likely to be where we are heading and as long as we don't make no mistakes we'll be here to talk about Biafran and Biafran actualization i want to say to my fifth chest nearby tila kaketa ah to poof a hotter before they will understand it's going to take a long time a very long time think it's a joke don't worry just hold your peace we're not struggling with anybody we're not even telling people not to do what they know how to do but just hold your peace and watch the way we are going to expose everything that is is doing economic viability only a country can have it only your z1 name. g7 1000 has just been unveiled by the biafran soldiers and this can easily take up this very weapon can easily take up 500 soldiers at once. But let's not divert the attention. 
The Biafran Navy are now in Portacourt and they are doing their job, of course. They are doing their job. According to Prime Minister Simon Eba, he has confirmed the whole curriculums, curriculums, if I must say. But one of the sweetest energy and one of the sweetest truths is this. We have for so long dished out <clears throat> so many positivity. It all started from people who don't know where they are going to people who now know what is happening. But one of the biggest message I must say today is that we have seen the way they treated those who are nobody. And we're not going to sit back and watch them treat us the same way. It's a very simple thought. If you must tell me the truth, it's a very, very simple thought. But one thing I must say today is that <clears throat> continually, more expectedly, everything will fix itself. Do you know that G7-1000 can take down an entire village if positioned well? It has that weapon has now reached the Biafran armies. We must be very consistent in what we are doing. We don't want war with anybody. We do not ask for war. But what we ask for is very important. And that one thing is give us Biafra. That's all. Give us Biafra, we need it. We need this Biafra, we need to, we need a country that is working, we need to develop ourselves. <coughs> we need to know where we are going from here. <coughs> it's a simple word. And that is why we cannot sit back and re-engage ourselves in a negative order. We must stay very focused, very focused in everything that has to do with Biafra naturalization. And that is why I'm speaking silently. Most of them do not want to see the light that we share. All they want to keep saying is what? What is in their mind? But that's the point. We are heading to that very point where each and every one of you should understand the price that matters most. Because if we don't do what is needful, more and more disaster will happen. That's where the whole situation from begins. We must be put across to engage ourselves. So we want to tell ourselves the truth. And that is where everything is not making sense. G1000 is at hand. The front victory is already at hand. And we are stepping into a new month. With lots and lots of celebration. That's what matters. <laughs>